Spiritual soul in the building. Gazer, gazer, nature soul in the building, man. Simple. Now check this out, man. My skin looking pretty smooth. Listen, females be like, bro, damn, my baby, what's your skincare product? Can't tell you. You know what I'm saying? Just, just get, just get in the sun, my baby, and put you on some lotion. Can't tell you my products. It's like, nah, bro. I don't do shit. I don't put nothing on my shit. I just get in the sun, put some hemp's lotion on, take a shower. That's it. The sun clear my skin up. So if you a nigga that's that that can't get in the sun, you ain't got no melanin and all that. That's why your skin look like that, bro. So understand this. Let's talk about strippers. I dropped a video yesterday letting y'all know, well, the day before yesterday, and I was basically letting y'all know it's not your fault. If you somebody who have a purpose and you can't find it, like you feel like you lost, ain't shit going good. You feel like you can't get signed. You feel like you being left out. I just wanted y'all to know it's not y'all fault. And I was letting y'all know a little bit how this matrix is run. And one of the things I talked about in the video was strippers. So let me tell you about strippers. I have no problem with strippers. If you a girl that strip right now, you can get hit. I ain't gonna lie, I still hit it. But at the same time, um, it depends on what energy you carry. So understand this real quick. And a lot of y'all got to start understanding me. If you can't meditate, most of the stuff you start hearing, like if I tell you aliens is already here, you a bot, you sleep. So you will look at me like, no, it ain't. I can't talk to you. I want to talk to your higher self. I can't talk to you. So y'all going to have to start understanding me. Google what understand means. Now check this out. Man, who the fuck is this outside my house? Hold on, who is this? I don't know, man. This better be motherfucking Whole Foods. I don't trust nobody. Let me see if he got a Whole Foods bag in his hand. Hurry up, big fella. Look how Arizona niggas dress. Look at this guy. What is them shacks you got on, my nigga? You y'all wear shacks? Oh, yeah, this my Whole Foods guy. He delivering my groceries. All right, I was just making sure. All right, yeah, I'm lazy. I'll get my groceries delivered. That shit, it ain't no Whole Foods nowhere near me. That shit like an hour away. I'm not driving nowhere no more. I just got into a car accident the day before yesterday. I'll drop a video about it, real shit. My life, I be going through the most shittiest things in my life because I'm the chosen one. The chosen ones go through the most shit. We always have shit going good and something. Always got to fuck it up and we always overcome it. So look, let me talk to you about strippers real quick. Get back on topic. So if you're a stripper right now, you have to understand everything is energy. So if you was a stripper and you was to come into my house right now at this particular moment, I could feel your energy that you carry. So when you're in a club 24-7 around all these different people, around all these different males, these males, they be nasty drunk. You have to understand most of the time when you drunk, look up what's really taking over your body when you drunk. You ever know somebody who got super drunk and they and they blacked out and they ain't remember nothing the next day? You would just be telling them like, bro, you was doing this, you was doing that. That was somebody else controlling their body. Simple. Everything is energy. Energy could take over your body if you have a very low vibration. Normally the ones that take over their body, like if y'all see somebody who super strung out on drugs, they be all weird like the motherfuckers on Worldstar, that be demons taking over their body. They put this shit in drugs. This is what's in the drugs. Everything is energy. It's in your GMO food. So this, this dark energy, it feeds off your emotions. So if you're a stripper, it will make you never want to quit stripping. You will probably be mad at yourself all the time. You will be hating yourself for what you live in because you know you are way more than a stripper. These, energy was, these energies would be feeding off all that them emotions you're doing bashing yourself. It makes you hate yourself. Makes you down yourself. Yet, you will still continue to go keep shaking that ass in the club. So let me let you know how this energy work. This meat is not real. When you die, the soul leaves the body. I told you that. Everything is energy. This is an illusion. What you see with these two eyes, we only see 1%. 1%, bro. 1% of what's really in front of us. 1%, bro. Out of 100%, we only see 1% of what's really in front of us. So you people that take psychedelics, of course, they're going to ban psychedelics. Psychedelic drugs is spiritual drugs. They made for spiritual so you could connect with the source way better. They banned all that shit. They banned psychedelics, but cigarettes is free. 
Cigarettes kill people, cause can all type of shit. It's rat poison in cigarettes, all type of stuff. But that's that that's not banned. But they're gonna ban a psychedelic drugs to where you could see the source, you could connect with your guardian angels. When people be on psychedelics, they say they hallucinated. No, they able to escape this matrix for a little bit and get a chance to get a glimpse at other realms of realities that's already in front of us. So while we right here chilling, you have a spirit world too. They chilling just like us too. You have other dimensions. You exist in other realities. All You got all type of superpowers. You just got to learn how to bring your energy up high enough to where you can connect with the source, connect with nature. Eat healthy and all this shit and you will notice all this stuff. You will notice how fucking strong you are mentally. You'll start manifesting crazy stuff. You'll start seeing glitches in the matrix. You'll start getting them answers from nature. You'll start knowing everything. Let's get back on topic. So, if you're a stripper, you came in my house right now. I could feel all that energy you feeling. All the males that touched you. All them niggas you danced on. If you a female, you a girl, you like sex. What do you think is, is, is addicted to sex? It's not you. Because it's going to come a point in time in your life, you're going to look back at the stuff you was doing, and you're going to hate yourself for it. It happens to everybody. The only ones that don't happen to is the soulless beings that's here. The clones, soulless beings, the free walkers. It's some people here that's just filling in space for the matrix. They might be working on the news stations and shit. They don't, they have no, no soul. So when you in the club, they got 440 Hertz music playing in, in most, not all the clubs, obviously. Most big concerts, most clubs, you got all these people. It's like going to church. The reason why people still believe in religion, because when they go to church and all them people put their energy towards this pastor, everything they put their energy towards, they will feel that that love. But that same love they feeling, if they put that energy towards within they self and start healing they self, they can feel that at home. Right. That same energy all the people putting towards in church is the same way when you at a concert, when you at a concert, you got this 440 Hertz music playing and you got all these people surrounded by demons. If you used to open your third eye, you would see everything. That's why a lot of people be fucked up when they open their third eye. Because they not ready for it. That's why you got to be in the gym with your life now. Then when your third, like if my third eye was to open now. Bro, look at all the videos I post. Nigga, I'm going to be super ready for this shit. No, I'm going to be ready for it. You got to be in the gym with your life. So we talk about strippers. Strippers, you in a club with 440 hertz music. You surrounded by all these drunk niggas. They probably out here messing with bodies. They probably killers, all type of stuff. The energy that they carry, if they touch you, that energy is now on you. So if I was to have sex with a thought, she could be a, a vampire. When I say vampire, an energy vampire. You ever came across people who all of a sudden come around you and you was perfectly fine at first, but then they come around and now you just, you don't really like doing nothing no more when they come around. You really want to be away from them. You want to chill or something. It's just something not right. Like, you'll be perfectly fine, but every time this particular person come around, you, they don't even know that you don't even like them. They ain't even never done nothing to you, but it's just a vibe, the energy that they carry. Once you learn energy, you will learn the matrix because everything is energy. So if a girl come in my house, let me show y'all something real quick. Let me show y'all something. I'm in the gym with my life, my baby. This shit is not a fucking game. Yeah, this matrix is, but my life not. So if a girl was to come in my house right now, so y'all see, y'all see how I got all these plants, crystals. I got protection to protect my energy. My energy is so high. Everybody I come around, I uplift. That's how it is. Everybody you come around, they seem to be they self. They way happier. They able to get ideas that they want. Everybody you come around, you uplift. That's how it is. You are the chosen one. They could feel your energy. Your energy makes them feel alive. So if you was to have sex with a, a stripper, she would drain your soul. And it's not her. It's the energy that she carry. Demons feed off your energy. So when a stripper be in a club 24-7, it's a reason why she can't stop stripping. They make her think. That this money is everything. This material shit is everything. But when you die, how much is them thongs, bra, and panties going to be worth? 
When you turn 30, you can't strip. If you over 30 still stripping, no, that's tough. That's tough. If you almost 30 and still stripping, that's tough. Tough. So, everything is energy. That's how I feel about strippers. That's how I feel about anybody that come around me with this dark energy. And when my third eye open, I'm going to be able to show y'all everything and tell y'all everything. But right now, I know how I feel. If you're not able to pay attention to how you feel, you lost. You out here fucking these thoughts and, and doing all this different shit. Meanwhile, this same thought that just stole your energy is about to go fuck another nigga and another nigga passing all your energy around. Meanwhile, you stuck with the energy that she just got from another badass person and put in you. Now you just had sex with this girl. Meanwhile, your life will start to turn to hell. Shit will start going wrong. You will start feeling some type of way about certain shit. You will have certain energy throughout your house because you brought this thought in your house. She probably was a bug. Probably was an ant. Eh. You know what I'm saying? She probably was something we don't know about. You got to understand that. Okay, remember, we only see, remember, we only see 1% of what's really out here with these two eyes. You, you don't know who around you. You could be laying next to one of them motherfuckers right now. You could turn and look at this motherfucker. She look beautiful as hell, right? But that's a motherfucking centipede next to you right there. If you mirror gaze before, if you mirror gaze and you look at yourself in the mirror long enough, your face will start to change. You are not who you are, bro. This is not you. <laughs> this is not you This is your avatar Everything is energy dog So I'm trying to tell you Most of the people that you bring around you Could be something totally different They don't even know who they are They don't even know who they are You don't even know who you are Unless you start tapping in and meditating Pay attention to how you feel so that's how I feel about strippers, man. So if you're a stripper, you can still get piped. It's just the energy that you carry on a regular basis, man. Don't nobody want that shit around us. And y'all have to understand, in this day and age, the reason why strippers is overpraised is because it's an agenda, just like gun laws. I'm going to wrap this video up after saying this. Gun laws, when they bring y'all fake news about like fake school shootings and shit, and y'all know this, most of the school shootings be fake, y'all. It's, it's an agenda because they want to take our guns, man. They want to take our guns. Once they take our guns, man, they control the work. They sober. Even though most niggas' guns are already illegal, all the niggas in the hood guns are illegal. They're going to be eating. They're going to be robbing and killing. They're going to eat, eat. They can't wait. But for us who out here wanting to protect ourselves and shit, what we going to do? So you ask, why do they overpraise strippers? Why? How come most the girls on the top, the, the girls on the top charts on iTunes, Spotify, the girls that rap, how come all of them is thoughts? <laughs> <laughs> Thoughts get cheated on You ask yourself How come all these females All they sing about Is getting cheated on And heartbroken Why ain't no girl Rapping about being Or singing about Being on her shit Everything is an agenda To destroy our women Our beautiful women They want to destroy y'all They want you to go strip And be further away from yourself It's just like When you're in a strip club You're in a strip club From 18 to like 25 That's just like Being in school Being, in, being programmed in school Motherfuckers, we in school 24-7 learning social studies and then graduate and can't even find a job. Why was you in? Bro, listen, why are we in school learning? So, bro, I could have been at home three hours early. Why you give me these classes that was pointless? I could have been I could have been at home sleep. Imagine all the classes we took in school that was pointless. Imagine how much time we could have been at home for them pointless classes. Nigga, I would have been in school two hours a day. All I needed to learn was how to read and write. That's that 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 take a day. That that only take like a couple hours. I'm, I could go to the crib now. Motherfuckers be throwing us in school. Huh? Take your ass to school. If you don't go to school, I'm taking your parents to jail. My kids getting homeschooled. I have a motherfucking nanny on the payroll. Fuck that. I'm gonna be teaching their ass. They gonna be in this bitch like these. Literally. Simple. Anyway, 
So they want to praise our strippers. So when the girl graduates from high school, she see these strippers on Instagram who we see clearly. People like me could see clear as day is lost. And hate they self and depressed. We could see it. We could feel their energy. They don't like they self. Strippers reach out to me all the time. As fat looking sexy as hell, but down at herself because she in a strip club surrounded by all this negative energy that's making her hate herself. So, take care of yourself, man. Everything is an agenda. They want your daughter to look up to strippers. They want all the female artists to be heartbroken. No matter what skin color you are, they want all y'all to be ratchet thoughts. You notice every girl get paid to wear bikinis. Every girl get paid. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Every girl is getting paid to wear to be half naked. I, I, of course us of course us dudes like it, but when you become woke, you see the agenda behind it. They want, man, I'm telling you, even girls on video game asses is fat. Why is the girls on the video game? You go on Fortnite, the girls on Fortnite ass fat as hell. Everything is about sex, bro. Everything is about sex. Take care of yourself, bro. Spirits of sauce, honey.